Where are we going, guys? The Living Lobby the Tea! The tea. Here we go. Woo! <laughs> there she goes. Woo! <laughs> we are headed off to the cruise and we've got some Mickey who's keeping us company. And so the shuttle ride's gonna be about an hour from the hotel to the port. And uh, you ready? Yep, let's go. Panda is actually old enough to go to like the tween hangout called The Edge. It'll be our first time doing that, so let's see how it goes. The one with the Mickey ears, you gotta sit down. We're here, you see the ship? Hi, Goofy. We are the water factory. Now, are these for fighting too, or just wishing? We are the Oh. Yeah, Dad, obviously. We the family. You think she's gonna let down her hair for me? Oh, it's not even tangled! Please welcome aboard the Let down your hair! That's yes! Not, that's not tangled! That's, that's um, not Rapunzel! That's Belle! No! Maybe Belle's hair is long enough. No! No! no. Maybe she can Please welcome aboard the water! This is actually pretty cool. This is the entrance to the Oceaneer Club. This is where Cal, Tiger, and Badger will be hanging out. Probably about 90% of the time, to be honest, guys. Now, this is a bohemian itinerary, and of course, we will make a stop at Disney's private island of Cosmicky. All right, so I came up after Gina. Guys, I've got a stroller. There's no way I'm getting in there. It's like, if you don't get to things early here, just give up. Yeah, I'm not gonna any way shape or form be able to make it over there with a stroller we're just gonna find a cool spot and uh and chill Let's see if we can find a place to sit what do you got over there is that a salad or what Oh, the tortellini. Yeah, the tortellini. Oh, well, you gotta try it. I did. What does it taste like? Not my favorite. Okay, but what does it taste like? like um, it's like cheese. I thought you loved cheese. I do, but it's not. It's like interesting. Oh. Interesting. Okay, okay, I got you, I got you. Hot chicken pot pie. Have you eaten any yet? It looks fancy. Is it good? It looks like Badger got the same chicken pot pie with fries. Mom and Penguin ended up going back to the room. Penguin was pretty much having a meltdown and we were getting her food to go. So we've got her appetizer here. We have her tuna and her salad over here. And then her entrees will take up to the room for her. I think she's putting Penguin to sleep to be honest. It's been a long day traveling and he didn't get a nap today. Oh my goodness, guys, I was so excited to eat. So the steak is absolutely delicious. And then you have green beans and bacon and mashed potatoes and then a sauce. How is it, Panda? Good. Panda actually asked for A1 sauce and then the guy thought he said angry sauce. <laughs> Did you end up getting your angry sauce? <laughs> All right, guys, I made it back. <laughs> I don't believe. I made it with all this stuff without dropping any of it. How you feeling, baby? Exhausted. Penguin fell asleep? Yeah. boy. <laughs> he was fussy tonight. Holy cow. Like a complete terror in the dining room. Uh, so much that Gina ended up leaving and uh, I got to bring her all her food. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm here early to the theater. We see only a few people here. They've got popcorn, candy, sodas. We'll see if the kids ask for anything. We just ate dinner, but you never know. So we'll see when the doors open. Please welcome your cruise director, Carly. Who do you think is me with? Yeah. 
We let Mama know we see land. What do you say? Thank you. One thing I do like about the Disney Cruise that you don't get other places is that um, you don't have drink packages. So they just have like juice and soda available everywhere. Obviously, if you do alcohol, that's an extra expense or extra charge. But like just regular drinks, they always have everywhere. So I don't know. I think this might be like my favorite buffet because I thought I liked the one on the Dream. Yeah. But this one is just like I don't know if it's just I'm pretty sure it's just the aesthetic of everything. It just looks nicer. I'm just hungry. Whatever. I look at everything. I'm also a person that's like very particular about my buffets. And so like it looks really, everything looks so, so good. I actually am going to go up to go get more hash browns and some yogurt. Okay. I just booked our spa for two. And what's really nice is that the kids are going to go to the Oceaneer um, Club. And then Drew and I are going to go to the spa, and then Penguin is going to go to the nursery. Um, if they have like a big problem, then they send you messages through the app. And so like anything that's wrong, it's not like you're finding out when you get here. They update you, and then if your kid's like, like they cannot control this and they're crying, then they'll send you a message like, hey, your kid's, you know, a little upset. We're going to try to calm him down. If he's not calmed down, we'll send you another message to come pick him up or them up. So I really like that because now I feel like I I'm in the loop of everything that's happening. What are you doing here? Contemplating life? <laughs> so Penguin brought this little puppy that copies you. It's his favorite toy right now. See, I would suggest like getting, a, making appointments. Like if you can already schedule everything, go ahead and make appointments as soon as you can because it makes it a lot easier because uh, like you can see right there like I was able to get it but like it's kind of like a little bit of like inconvenience it's, yeah because our spa's at two and his check-ins at two. two I can say I feel like a lot more nervous usually splitting the kids up into different areas like because we have kids in three different locations on the ship so like they have a whole check-in process they have pictures of each of the kiddos and the only people who can like pick them up so we have exactly who can pick them up did you know they have GPS in their watches too yeah, so, so the alarm goes off if mm -hmm. they get out of the area when they're checked in they have passwords so like when you come pick up your kid like there's a special password it's been the best process for daycare that I've seen it yet it's this one I'm at what does the winner get? What does the winner get? A cookie? Winner gets a cookie? No, the winner gets the same. The last winner didn't get a cookie. Yeah. Who was the winner? Me. Oh, I'll have to get you a cookie. Oh, no. No, she won. So I'm pretty sure, guys, that Gina just put the reason for her pain is me on here. I did not. <laughs> Let me see. What did you put? I don't, I did not put your name on there, look. Feet, calves, okay, okay. I should put husband. Okay, you should put husband on there. This is really cool, guys. These are water beds, like water beds. This is beautiful. Oh my goodness, this is Do we get to use this spot? I don't know, but I want to ask. Oh, it swirls in the glass too, look at that. Yeah. Where are we going, guys? The the baby 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 baby. Baby. Do you know who you're choosing? Ariel. Tis well. Rapunzel. Yeah, <gasps> I love it. Your girl looks so cute. I'm proud of you guys all know your sizes. Who was the character from Encanto that drew the flowers? Or in Kent? Isabel. Oh my goodness! <laughs> so good. Alright, you guys ready to see this, your siblings? I'm ready. Let's see what they Alright, let's like. go. Open up. Wow! Wow, beautiful! Oh, 
I can say, guys, the only thing I really don't like about the really short cruises, because we're on a three-day cruise, is like how short of time you have to do things. We're back at the room now, getting changed into our pirate costumes. Look at these ears, you guys. These are probably the most like decked out Mickey ears I've ever seen. Pirates can wear pink. I didn't say they can't wear pink. I'm just saying it would clash with their outfit. Look at her face. Oh, you look really good. You think those are the sandals? Looks good. It does. I take my He's the captain. He's the captain. Yummy, the baby, the captain. Are you oh. a captain? <laughs> I am. I am. <laughs> Through the power of quantum science, we will show you how together we can change. See you guys. Bye. All right, that had to be one of the best dining experiences I think I've had on the ship. We're done eating. Deciding right now if we're gonna go see the fireworks upstairs and the the pirate sail away party. So hey guys, um, I'm heading to the edge right now, and basically, it's this place where it's like the tweens area. This is the entrance. I have to get in with my key card. Hey, you oh my God! So, Look at you. so basically. Um, I think so. So these are one of the um, directors at Edge. Yeah, I'm the boss. <laughs> so this is basically my favorite game right here. It's um like teaching you how to play um, with a certain type of controller. We're doing some musical chairs. Nah. -uh. Yes, we are. Nuh-uh. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Now you put me down, I knew you were the chair. Hey, Dad. Yeah. All right, let's go. Okay, let's go. We're going to watch the Little Mermaid movie. All right, Badger. What did you think about this show, sweetie? You liked it? What's your question? Can I go up the stairs? Sure, I'll follow you up the stairs. Yeah. <sighs> I don't know what's wrong with these kids. They just want to take the stairs every time. I'm getting too old for this. As you guys can see, Gina and Penguin are out. So basically I wanted to show you where we are. <laughs> So we are finally off the ship. We're at Castaway K with the whole family. I need to show you guys the girls' cute matching bathing suits. Look, we got Lilo's changed bathing suits. <laughs> and Mickey ears. I know, I know. I know, Sebastian. And adorable Mickey swim trunks too. That's matching as well. I'm wearing red and green as the girls are, so it's kind of matching. Uh, they didn't have anything for adults for me, so I just kind of had to like match as close as possible. But thank, thank you. Here's a quick tip: walk when you're going to go uh, off the ship. Don't take the shuttle. Walk everywhere. You get to see more characters. And also, Drew wanted me to show you guys the girls' glasses, all, all the kids' glasses. So we got like Little Mermaid, Ray-Ban sunglasses. I think all of them got them. Tiger, come here, baby. Okay, if you look really closely, they have like little, I don't know how well you guys can see, they have like little uh, silhouettes of the Little Mermaid and stuff like that underneath the sea. So just to clarify for you guys, you can take the first tram to the first stop and then that's where all the characters are. You don't have to walk to the characters. Get on the tram, get off at the first stop, and you're gonna see all the characters there. Now, the tram goes to multiple stops. If you're wanting to go straight to the beach, then you get off at the second stop of the tram. So first stop for characters and the youth activities, like they have a youth club back there that you can drop the kids off at. Um, second stop for beach. And I think there's a third stop for like Serenity Bay, which is 
maybe adults only or something like that. I don't know. Maybe I'll figure it out here in a minute. <laughs> what a fun time, you guys. One of my favorite parts is coming to Castaway K. It's absolutely beautiful. Like two plates, like three plates of bacon. Bye, Castaway K. Bye. Bye. This video just does not do this justice. How giant this ship is. You guys, this place is pretty amazing. Let me show you. We're in the Castle Arendelle. Thank you, Aiden. You're pleasing your ears. Looks like a pot pie or a, looks like an onion soup. It's too hot to be able to tell. Come back, we'll come back. Okay. To you. That looks delicious. Pan is working on his salad. So Penguin had a corn dog and he ended up with mac and cheese. And Panda's getting old enough that he does not want to order off the kids menu anymore. Only adults menu. So he has to wait for his food now. Let the sun rise. You can eat it, Bubby. You eat it.